Hey there, it's Carla from Sea Love Plans. I am coming to you today because I got a very special box from Erin Condren. Um, I got an early preview of the Life Planner and some accessories. I'm so excited. I just wanted to say thank you to Erin Condren and Tori Johnson and anybody else on the Erin Condren team that is sending all of these happy mail boxes out to all of the EC squad in order for them to review them for you, to have them in our hands, smell them, love the smell of planners. I know I'm not the only crazy one out there that loves the smell of planners. I am going to go through some of these wonderful items with you and I hope you enjoy. This is the brand new life planner. The theme I chose was the layers. I also chose this year to get a rose gold coil. Last year I had the platinum, but this rose gold I thought looked really, really well with the layers cover. And I did get the neutral, and I also chose to get vertical, so I am changing things up a little bit this year. And so I really love the vellum on these planners. I like just the transparency of this, and I like just that extra added touch as well. And then all of these quotes, I know not everybody is a quote person, but I've always really enjoyed having these quotes in these planners. And this is your 2021 tab. It has all of your um, months of the years that you're going to need starting in July of 2020, going all the way to December of 2021. And I did choose to get a 12 month planner. I did not get the 18 month. And then the next page you have is your 12 boxes. Um, some people use these for monthly goal. And so I'm just not really sure what I'm gonna do with that quite yet. And then you do have a lined page here. And then the top is just has an outside dotted line. So there's no color on this at all. And so this is a very, very neutral planner. And I really like that because I like to be able to add my own style, my own flair, my own color themes, starting in July of 2020. So each month of this neutral planner does have um, a different color theme. There's four different colors and they rotate each month. And another thing that I love that has been changed this year is when you open the monthly tab, you get the monthly calendar. The dashboard is after and you do get a lined page here as well. Last year it was the dot grid, but this year it is the lined. And then here's your dashboard. So you do have the colors here. You have purple for July. And another thing that I really do like about this is they got rid of the titles. Um, the very beginning of the, the first planner I got last year, I did use this page. This one had the birthdays and this one had the monthly goals. But I also use my monthly view. So in my monthly view, I also keep my birthdays. So I personally thought that it was over redundant for me, for what I did, to have this as birthdays with the title of birthdays. So I really like that they got rid of the titles here. So that way you can create it and customize it to whatever is going to work for you. And so once you have your dashboard, you go straight into the week. Another thing that I love about the change this year in the neutral is that it is neutral. There are no colors on here. The only color that you get when the month changes is this tiny itty bitty little dot right there. And that tells you that the month has changed. So you have your three boxes. You have the tiny header up here. You do have this little strip right down here. And then you have your four lines down here as well. So another change that they have made is this calendar used to be down here. Now it's up here. And then I'll test some stickers out. Um, a little bit too and just see what sizes covers those. I personally do not use this calendar um, in my weekly planning, but I know that a lot of people do and a lot of people love it. And so you've got your weekly view here. And then once you're done with all of your weeks, you have another lined page here with your dots here or your dotted, um, excuse me, your dotted outline header there and you go straight into your next month and so this month is a light teal again this is the only color that you get in the planner 
and then your dashboard. Okay, so this planner goes from July 2020 all the way to June 2021. And then your month colors, so you have a peach in September, and then another blue in October, a light purple in November, a teal-ish in December, and then another peach. And then they just rotate those colors just over and over until the planner ends. So in the back, you have your note pages. And these are all lined pages this year as well. There's no design on the side, which I really like because that way I can definitely utilize the entire space. There's no coloring pages added right here either. And then you go straight to your contacts. And then you have your next year's at a glance with little bullet points here and then lined space down here to jot down ideas or plans for those upcoming months. And then you get to the stickers. So I really like these stickers this year. Um, I really like these with these nice clean lines. I love those clean lines instead of the rounded corners. And then I also love that all of these trackers are all the same color. You don't have different shades of different colors. I really like having all one color. And so that way I don't have to worry about putting too many colors in my week if I wanted to just do all one color for a week. If I needed multiple trackers to track multiple things, I like that they're all one color this year. And so look at that foil, it's so pretty. And I really like these to-do scripts. Those I really like too. And then here is your happy birthday and celebrating page with all of your silver foil. Again, I really like these super duper rectangular sharp lined boxes. I like those a lot better than the, the rounded edges. And these are your rounded edge boxes that they have as well. And these have changed a little bit this year as well. This area is a little bit smaller, but these still, um, fit really well in the planner as well. And so that is your planner. And then a couple of the other things that I got was a ballpoint pen in the layers. Look at how pretty that is. I love the gold on it as well. I really like this case and this turquoise inside the case is really nice too. It's a really pretty case. And then I got a sticker book. Guys, I got the layered sticker book. I'm so excited for these. I'm actually going to try one of these stickers on the calendar up here to see if it is going to be a full coverage. I really, really like this sticker book. So this one is all of your gold foil. I really love these hearts. And then I do love quote stickers. And then you've got all of these. Shopping list, dinner plans. And I like these asterisks as well. And you got your to-dos, your love, more to-dos, plain ones, your flags. These are the ones that are kind of that see-through material as well. And this is probably my favorite page. So I really like these new script stickers that they're doing. And I like that you get an entire page of it as well. If they sold these separately, I would absolutely buy them. And then you get your weekend banners, which I really like. 
vacations, fun trips. These are really fun. I've always really liked little dots. And then these ones are nice. It's a plan, reminder, goal. And I love these colors. Purple's my favorite color. So these are definitely my favorite colors. And again, with these hearts, they're so cute. I love those hearts. And then you've got your washi. So the only thing with the washi that comes in these books is I like them, but I really wish that there was two of the same pattern. I've always found it really hard for me personally to put down one washi on this side and then not having a corresponding on this side, the same pattern. Yes, you could do two of these, two of these, cause they are still yellow, one on each side, but I really like symmetry. And so if they ever came up with pages of these, of the washi strips that were multiple, so you can use one on each page, I would definitely love that. Um, and I know a lot of people use these um, vertically as well to kind of block off times also, and I have done that in the past as well. So that is also a good use for those. And then this is your last page in the book right there. All right, so I am going to, I'm gonna try this box right here. You are capable of amazing things because I would like to see if it covers this calendar. And it does, it's a perfect coverage for that calendar. And so you don't even see any writing on the edges or the top. You don't have any designs around it. It's a perfect coverage for that calendar. Great. I'm actually going to leave that there because I really like it. All right. And then other things that I got that I use a lot in planning, which I'm very excited about. Sticky notes. I love, love, love sticky notes. I use them a lot in my pre-planning. And I actually use these long ones a lot in my months and so what I will do in my months is in August I'll just put one sticky note right here and then every time I have an appointment or a school event or anything that pops up I'll write it here so say I'm in May of 2020 and I need to schedule something for August I'll write it on this sticky note right here and then come closer to August I'll transfer all of this to my main calendar so I really like these sticky notes and they actually fit the areas really, really well. And so these triangles fit the corners very nicely. There you go. Look at that. How nice is that? And then you've got your circles. I really like that circle. That circle is really pretty. And I'm curious with these, if they fit this box. Look at that, perfect fit for the width of the box. Obviously not the height, but the width of the box is a really nice fit. So if you ever had to just keep that there for a little bit, um, it could still look really good in your planning as well. So I got the floral ones too, which I'm actually very excited about. I really, really liked the floral pattern but I just couldn't I just couldn't do the colorful but I really love these again purple favorite color and then these long ones again I absolutely love and then I also got extra of the stickers that come in the back of the planner and so you get one extra of each sheet And again, with these trackers, I love that they're all the same color. All right, and then last but not least, it's the compliment cards. I actually really like these compliment cards. And I love the sayings on them now as well. Love yourself. You are enough, let your dreams take flight. And I like that they're empty um, on the back. This one is just explaining what the things are. I like that they're, they're empty on the back 
So you can just write a quick little note, leave it on someone's windshield when you're going in and out of a store or just keep them in your purse. They're a perfect size to just kind of keep in your bag and stuff. And so I really like being able to have these and then you can always keep your pen in your purse as well. And then you'll be able to really quickly just jot a note on the back and then just leave it for someone or send it in happy mail. So I really like the compliment cards as well. I did also get one of the dashboards in the colorful layers, which is just so vibrant and so pretty. So this one has priorities and to-dos on the front and on the back, it has a full week schedule. And these are really nice because you can snap it straight into your planner. And you can always have this with you. And another reason that I really like it is because it sticks out from the top. And so it acts as a bookmark as well. And so you'll always have it with you. And so that way you can open it up, know exactly where you are. You can have your menu for the week or anything else that you would utilize that for. And this is it. This is all of my fun stuff that I got. And I would definitely like to thank Erin Condren Tori Johnson, the entire EC team for sending all of this beautiful stuff to me. So that way I can let you guys see it. And if you have any questions, please feel free to message me. Um, I will do my best to answer. And then if you are shopping today, I hope you enjoy. I do have an affiliate link in my bio as well. If you would like to shop through my affiliate link, I do make a very small percentage and this collection is absolutely beautiful. And I hope that you guys enjoyed and let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.